Ooh, what is up you guys? And of course, welcome to another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle with your truly, the Skyrender. And today we're going against um, the Rizzle Man, right? Our name is Thomas, of course, and uh, we're going for a Yu-Yu game, which is terrifying Consider how accustomed I am to that playstyle. Then again, I mean, it doesn't mean anything if uh, I ain't accustomed to it, but I now realize that I might be a bit too weak to ice, so that cloister is going to be an issue. And we got Lyford, Magneton, right? And uh, Gudra seeking with a lightning rod and uh, Theraborn. So, a lot of big threats on this team. A lot of big threats. The thing is, though, I do expect him to be super aggressive and go for the cloister during the get-go. Or am I? I know I would. Hmm. Or I'll try to take... You know what? Um, I do like this. I try to start off with Aesol. I don't know if that's going to help out at all. But we'll, we'll just have to find out, pretty much. Um... I am a little scared, because like I said, not accustomed to the tier means that the, he has not necessarily the upper hand, but I'm not entirely sure I <laughs> will stand up to the damage here. And there's the Cloyster, like I did expect, that is unfortunate. Um, I think he did the right call. I really, 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 really do. Um, damn it! I was actually thinking about going for going for Agron. I might be forced to do just that, and um, it it could pack waterfall. If that's the case, then you know that is just unfortunate. Um, it goes directly for the shell smash, and I think that's the right thing to do because it's gonna pack a white herb at best. Or well, not at best, it's gonna pack the white herb. He is not packing the white herb. Hmm. I wonder. I wonder. I might be better off going for the T wave here, but yeah. Here comes the Seeking. How did I not see that one coming? Or no, not Seeking. Huh. Still, he's still immune to it, so it's not like it will <clears throat> affect him. But if he would go for Seeking, I will probably, you know, that will be just a great call. Um, so, right, I am locked in. I think, so I need to, um, or am I? Let's see if I am. No, even if I'm, you know, not... Uh, how much do a hidden power fire do from this range? I'm just gonna go for an earthquake right off the bat. And uh, there's a hidden power, like I said, most likely fire. And it! It goes for some decent damage, it really does. And I'm pretty sure that is sturdy. It is not sturdy. That is just great. So, still though, a lot of damage to my Aggron. Ah! And the safest bet from here was the Gudra. Perfect. Mm. I wonder if I can make this thing a bit sharper. Sorry guys, two seconds to see if this... Oh, that was too much. But that was definitely better. I'm sorry for the blur. I'm sorry for the lightning behind me. It seems to be reflecting the screen. But we just have to cope with that. Um, what did this thing really want to do though? Um, hmm. I'm going into Bat Clan. And Bat Clan is of course... The spooky and very, very desirable Crobat Flamethrower. Alright, so I can assume it is a special set. I can even assume that it's gonna pack quite a punch on me. Um, that was actually really unfortunate. It should have ice cream if that's the case. 
or not should, it's going to have an ice beam. So, you turn? Alright, we draw that, I guess that's fine. Shuckle. Yeah, perfect. This is gonna hurt me more than it hurts him. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Still though, I can bring Aesil here. And he's going to... Actually, I think my good position here is to actually go for a nasty plot. See if he stays in. Because I would definitely have switched out probably to the Cloyster. Oh, to the Gudra. Right. I'm cool with that. Hmm. Still, though, the special offense that this thing is bringing. Uh, I'm pretty much better off going for a Psy Shock than going for a Dazzling Link. And going for that 2 hit KO might be the better choice. I know this thing can pack a, um, a Soul Fest if you're unlucky. Let's just, you know, take him, deal some damage. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, barely cut it. Barely cut it. Alright. Oof. Oof, 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 oof. Bad boy. Ouch! That is not okay. That is not okay at all, actually. Um, Dazzling Gleam? Probably gonna father it, yeah. Sounds about right. Ah, oh, that is extremely unfortunate. Ooh, foo foo foo, that hurts. So, yeah, there's the Bandit, which is the Cloister. And he's going to live no matter what. And he's sashed. For all sense and purposes, he's definitely sashed. So I need to break it anyway. So I'm just gonna go right back to Flamethrower. It's not by any means going to take him out. Oh, I shot, of course. Damn it. Nice call. <sighs> hmm. Well. Good thing I only got a lot of ice weaknesses left, it's gonna help me out a lot. So I think I'm bringing this guy and I'm gonna go for a thunder wave, hoping for him to shell smash or switch out. And if he switch out, I'm hoping he's go for the um, for the seeking, because I do want to have this on my video. Thank you. Now now everything is fine. I really, really believe that this was necessary, even though I did see it coming. Uh, I just wanted it to get, you know, out of the way. Uh, <laughs> so, Dayenshi is coming in. It is really my best bet, and I'm just gonna set up Reflect and Stealth Rocks. Probably gonna start with the Stealth Rocks. So, he's going for the Agility. Alright. Hmm. Still have to find out what kind of set it is. Just go into out speed anyway. Can I go for a knockoff? Or what are you gonna do? Let's just get rocks up. My Dianchis really can't do too much in this battle. Um, I'm probably gonna take that fairly well. Yeah. But no. Why? <laughs> Damn it. Alright. Seems only fair to consider how strong of a team I have. Uh, so yeah, there we go. So worth it. Freaking please. When it's gonna go, you keep going at it. Uh, I see no reason to not do it. Right? Uh, hmm. I wonder. I think it's gonna go for another waterfall. Still, I have no like real Pokemon that can take that well. 
at all. But at least I know my goal by the DB light, so I can scout it. Uh, see how much a waterfall do. Oh, poison jab, alright. So that doesn't do too much, but I know a knockoff will. I can at least go for Roost just to try to find out. Alright, directly for the waterfall. Um, I'll say it did some fair damage. I'll say. So I'm back on track there. Um, let's see if he switch out. No body slam. With normal gem. Oh my. <laughs> nice. <laughs> um, Alright, he, he should have deserved a uh, fully paralyzation there or get me paralyzed. Um, Alright, let's see if I can take another waterfall. I can't help but laughing, it's kinda of funny. <laughs> oh, hoo 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 hoo, we're no flinching here. This gold bat is gonna be the end of him. So, do I expect him to switch into his Spera form? Time to do that. I might as well roost up. Alright, he keeps going at it. Um, he's gonna get the full paralyzation eventually, so I guess that's fine. Um, Alright, that should do the trick. I'm pretty much just waiting to get paralyzed. Um, seems like it is. Um, 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 um. Poison Fang. It's alright, finally switch out to the Veraphone, right? Thunderous, right? Light Pod. Come on, we're gonna get this badly poisoned and we'll be just perfect. There we go, 50% working in its favor. Finally. And I'm hurt by the Rocky Helmets. That is just lovely. Hmm. Right, I am forced to switch out, I'm not gonna like try to convey something I can't resist there. Um, so go into my Dianchi, pretty much foddering it at this point. Let's see if he scouts with a substitute. What if we go with a. Uh, oh, right, Thunder Wave. So that seems right the right call to do if you were me. So it's forced to attack now, I guess. And I'm not entirely sure Dianchi can take any kind of damage from this range. They only have 17 in uh, HP left, so it's it's not that impressive. I see, there's a knockoff. Don't kill. <laughs> Please. <laughs> oh, I didn't die, but fully paralyzed. Awesome. Now that is how you do it. Um, still though, I, I don't think he'll survive if he stays in for attacking me, but he's kind of forced to do just that. So, let's see, there's a second knockoff. How unfortunate am I to get fully paralyzed? I'm gonna put up a reflect, consider his um, last teammates are pretty darn terrifying. Hmm, alright. So that means one thing, he's gonna go for a T-Wave no matter what. So which probe do I want to be paralyzed? Oh, ha, 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 damn it. I guess I have the least use of Valmawe in this battle. So... Curse, trying to get something out of this. Oh, he goes for a knockoff. That is okay, actually. Ah, that was that was actually better. Um, because the cloister can still come in and finish me off, no doubt about it, at all. But uh, I don't think the cloister can, you know, cope with the future here. Or rather, I should say, I am not entirely sure Cloyster can win the matchup that is um, um, that is the Agron. 
but I need to keep the aggro, you know, fairly alive. So if it's smarter, it's gonna go directly for the shell smash. So I do break its sub or its focus sash, if that's the case. Um, or I could just go for the icicle spear, and it should be able to take me out from this range. And I have nothing to, you know, to soak that at all. There's the icicle spear, and it should kill. It really should. I think this is a, like a sweeper set, so. Ooh. So it can. No, no, no. That that is never gonna do. There we go. Sorry, man. <laughs> so I got Bermuj, which is yeah. I have no like special sweeper left now, have I? I can't take it out from that range at all. I know he got Golden left, he got Theraphon left, all of them pretty you know, big threats. Hmm. And I got two Pokemons left that are definitely weak to ice. Hmm. The worst part is I need to bring my Aggron, but I don't know how much punishment an Aggron can take. I can't really go for a T wave because I kind of have to, but then again, I'll just have to satisfy for Dragon Tail. Um, hopefully, he brings the Cloister. No, that is the Shuckle. All right, and that is actually gonna hurt me more than hurts him. Or, you know, not at all. Huh. Guess that's fine then. Let's shut it down. So you're gonna set up all kinds of hazards, I guess. Oh, fully paralyzed, that is... That is real unfortunate. Mm -hmm. uh, but then again, I see no reason to switch out, even though I can't do too much to it. I still need to, you know, oh my god, that is never gonna do. There's the lead seat, perfect. So now I can't stay in, so that is, that is nice. He's gonna get some huge HP left, or back on, because because of my investment, and obviously because Veraphone, I don't have a huge HP base. Mm-hmm. 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 it is. Let's see if I can threaten him here with a uh, flamethrower. There's a stealth rock, can't expect it those eventually. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for Draco here. Alright, he stays in. Did not expect that. That did miserably. Of course it did. Jarable. Hmm, I wonder. Yeah, I said it's not fair damage. Hmm. God damn it. Well. They have crunched in. So I'm gonna hurt myself, I'm gonna hope for him being paralyzed. Defense drop, please. There's a second Jarabol. Should be close to finish me now. Ugh. I'm gonna die on switching anyway. Eh, might as well go for super power. <laughs> I guess that's my best bet. So, ooh, right, super effective damage. 
And the iron bar almost killed me, but the eye shot was definitely. Oh, it oh, you kidding me. <laughs> oh, I thought I had him. Alright, I actually thought I killed him. Well, fuck you then. Hmm. <laughs> Damn it. I actually think I lost. I really believe... Uh, I can only hope for him being fully paralyzed I get some HP back. Uh, if he gets the lead seat off, then that is just gonna be... Yes. Or... Both yes and no, really. Um, because my only attacking move is the U-turn, which... By practice, of course, is not gonna be enough. Um, and obviously I have no, not much to choose from, so I guess... The Seeking is like his best bet, really. Hmm. Yeah, it's definitely his best bet. And I can't paralyze it, and of course the Hazard will whittle me down. So the Pokemon that I needed to preserve is gonna take a good chunk of damage from the Waterfall that is incoming. Oh, he goes Recloiser. Still though. I am forced to dragon tail him. Because I'm pretty sure he outspeed me. Yeah. Just live. There's Icicle Spare. Come on, do your thing, Agron. Huh? Huh? Oh my god. That 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 kinda works. That kind of works, actually. Um, perfect. Don't miss. There we go. Let the hazard take care of that one. So there is that thing. Hmm. So it's gonna go for a waterfall, and um, I don't know how much damage it will do, but I have the potential to flinch me, which is gonna be unfortunate. Yes. Keep going for those details. Yes, so the hazards will kill him. The question is, will the hazards kill this one? Not enough. Okay, now I really have to attack him. Uh, come on. Come on. Just gotta do... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Agron! Agron! Yes! Yes! It is not effective! You are out! Mmm! Boom! I'm so... I'm so satisfied with this, damn it. The, then again, and uh, I guess I should say this right off the bat, he, Thomas really did a good game here. He is using weaker pokes and he rubbed me. Uh, he really dented my team throughout. And I barely made it. I barely made it. Oh my god. Thomas, what a game. <laughs> really, I mean, you definitely deserve all the credit here because I really believe you were definitely the better battler. I was just lucky. Well, lucky enough to have Agron right into the very end. And I really didn't believe he would pull through. I really didn't. So I'm very glad that, uh, you know, I didn't get swept there. And uh, really, wow. I mean, very, very good game, and um, yeah, Darisel man, he is the guy for you. Uh, so check him out on Twitter, I'm gonna link his Twitter address down below. And um, yeah, Thomas, thank you so much for this battle. Was Oof, burp there, sorry. It was definitely a close one. Oh, I was so stressed. Oh my god. Oof. Yeah, and Agron is awesome, wow. Really came to show in the very end there that you have to <laughs> you have to pull through in the right moment. Really have to showcase yourself.
So, right guys, you know, thank you as always for watching, of course, and, um, you know, remember, the sky is the limit. So have a good day and take care, right guys? Mm, bye.